and now the area's certified most accurate forecast. Your weather on the fives with meteorologist Jordan Lamers. Welcome back. It's quarter to six on this Friday morning. We had about an inch or less of snow move through Green Bay and the Fox River Valley off to the lake shore through the overnight last night. Came down pretty hard for quite some time, but now we're starting to clear out. Storm Team 5 Skyview Network is powered by Pella Windows and Doors overlooking the Fox River in Titletown where it is 12 degrees. Don't forget we have a breeze out there now. You might have heard it blowing around a little bit last night, and yeah, it continues this morning. So chilly, turning breezy and really staying breezy with some sunshine emerging. Eventually some clouds return for the late day today. Mid 20s will be our high temperatures compared to the highs around 40 we had yesterday. Yeah, I saw people wearing shorts out there, believe it or not. Single digits and lower teens, a pretty common rule here in northeast Wisconsin to kick off the day, but a west to northwest wind anywhere from 15 to 30 miles per hour. This is what it's doing to the wind chills, making it feel more like eight below in Green Bay, 16 below in Watoma, a lot of double digits below zero. Bottom line, we're bundling up today and we're covering all this skin up because we only get into the lower teens for, well, let's just say the middle afternoon. That's the best we can do with the feels like temperatures today. Now, notice the wind chills out to the west and northwest of us. It's even worse at Bismarck, North Dakota, where it's almost 40 below zero. Um, Minneapolis looks like they have a wind chill advisory as they approach 20 to 30 below there. And all that cold air riding down with a ridge of high pressure. Now, this is the snowmaker from yesterday. That's moving away from us. And as long as we have that around, we're still going to feature some of these breezy winds. But with high pressure moving in, that'll start to clear some of these clouds. We can see it right here on Futurecast. As we go into the mid to late morning, there's some sunshine. Afternoon, again, a few passing clouds certainly could be uh, possible. Here's a later night tonight as we head to bed, mainly clear skies. Now that'll bring in a pretty chilly night tonight. Saturday starts off with some sunshine, eventually mixes with a few clouds in the afternoon, but all day of Saturday looks to be dry. Here's Sunday though. If we zoom out, look at this. Late Saturday night into Sunday, a little band of snow will begin to work up from the south and really start to impact southern Wisconsin by Madison and Milwaukee. It will creep into the southern half of our viewing area. It's not going to amount to a whole lot and it'll be a lighter brand of snow. In terms of accumulation throughout the day on Sunday, it looks like around an inch or less for the good chunk of the area south of Shawano. You get to Fond du Lac and Sheboygan, you could be pushing a little bit over an inch, an inch to two inches there. So for today, mostly sunny skies, breezy and chilly with highs in the mid 20s. For tonight, it gets cold with just a few clouds and single digit air temperatures. Here's your seven day now. For tomorrow, less windy with sun and clouds in 24. For Sunday, light snow to the south in 23. And then on Monday and Tuesday, looks like we're drying out again, seeing some sunshine. Wednesday, looks like a good bet for some snow showers with a high of 25.